The council is made up of nine faculty members and we span the sciences, math, and engineering, and also the humanities. Our job is to make sure that every Princeton undergraduate who's going to major in humanities or social science comes out loving science, taking science, and being able to engage in science. We help revamp existing courses. We help make 21st century courses that will make students, graduates, no matter what they're going to be, be able to engage in science and use scientific thinking in all of their lives. We believe if a person is going to be a lawyer or a physician or a judge or an entrepreneur, he or she should be able to think logically and rigorously and quantitatively and use that in their daily lives and then also as they engage with the world. Regarding the learning experience in this course, I, I give lectures. We have clickers in the course and every five minutes there is a question they have to answer. And they really like it and most of the time I ask questions where they don't know the answer in advance. This is about just forming an opinion on something. Then I wait, I look at the answers, I immediately have an idea of how far they're off from reality. Um, and then I explain and then what I found is that they remember these things much better than just random facts that I told them. Because they already had an opinion. So A, they were completely wrong, then they remember that. Or they were right and they say, well, that was good. To students that may be apprehensive about taking science courses at Princeton, I think one of the greatest things about them is that you're able to carry that knowledge over um, into your other pursuits, particularly in the humanities. The courses themselves are crafted um, in order for you to develop a lens, for instance, for me, a cosmic lens and perspective uh, with which to be able to um, see and better understand the world in which I'm studying in my other disciplines. So I, I hope students who take this course will become better citizens because they understand critical thinking from this course. When they have to make a decision, they will think instead of act right away. They will try to find the causes and the reasoning, so they will develop this critical thinking. We are glad to take ideas for new classes or new parts of classes from anyone on campus, and that means faculty in any department, students, postdocs. What we want to do is to help people make their ideas for what would be a class that would sit at the interface of science, math, or engineering, and society, or policy, or art, or music. A class that would sit sort of at these interfaces but has no prerequisites. We would be glad to help make that come true.